Philadelphia police have released surveillance video of a shooting with a weapon of war inside a Philadelphia strip club. They are hoping that the video will help lead them to the gunman. Action News reporter Dan Quayer has that story. Police say 21-year-old Henry Pettigrew doesn't like it when they won't play his song. And back on May 11th, when the DJ at the Purple Orchid Gentleman's Club on South 61st refused to play his request, he left. Minutes later, he returned with an AK-47 and is so hammered, he slips and falls. He then gets up and he's so fixated on getting into that club, he gets into the club, slips again. But that didn't stop this guy. He gets up again, opens the door, and without even as much as asking people to say hello to his little friend, he just started firing. Just wildly, obviously, with an AK-47 with a banana clip, it can fire multiple rounds at a high speed very quickly. He then goes into the bar area and the DJ barely manages to die for cover as the crazed man fires indiscriminately. And you see one of the bullets actually strike the mirror right where his head would have been. So we're very fortunate that person did not get struck by this gunfire. Only minutes earlier, Pettigrew and his crew, apparently another man who served as his getaway driver, got into an altercation with the bouncers as they tried to throw them out. The two then mistook an innocent customer who was just walking in as one of the bouncers, and they pummeled him. That man then attempts to get away in his SUV when police say Pettigrew emerged with the AK-47 and fires a number of shots at the fleeing vehicle, striking the man above his right hip. Fortunate where it hit him, it went into flesh of his body and didn't hit any vital organs. Police say Pettigrew and his getaway driver, whose identity is unknown to them, got away in a light-colored sedan, possibly a Hyundai or Mitsubishi. With the gunman and the getaway driver still on the loose, a number of the workers here at the Purple Orchid up and quit their jobs. Meanwhile, police are asking anyone with information on the two men's whereabouts to please call 911. In Southwest Philadelphia, Dan Quayer, Channel 6, Action News.